This is a little signal diode, it's a 1N4148 and the forward voltage is 0.56. This is a rectifier diode, it's a 1N4005 and the forward voltage is 0.54. And this is a big 10 amp rectifier diode and the forward voltage a little bit lower at 0.46. Now this is a Schottky diode and Schottky diodes are a little bit different. They have a different junction construction. It's half semiconductor and half metal. And uh, they have a much lower forward voltage. This one is uh, 0.13. This is a 9 amp uh, Schottky diode. And because it's got this low forward voltage, it's much more suitable as a solar panel blocking diode. So, is there a way to get an even lower forward voltage from this diode? Let's try cooling it down. No, nope, the freezer spray results in a higher forward voltage. That's now 0.175. Let's try warming it up. Well now by heating that diode up, I've actually managed to get the forward voltage to go to zero and now it will gradually creep back up as that starts to cool down. That's pretty amazing. That's the perfect diode. But how do you keep a diode hot? That's a bit impractical really because um, there's a very small current flowing through this diode so under normal circumstances it just wouldn't get this hot.